Ideally, Hudson hopes to send all 12 of the shortlisted athletes, but a short notice of change in host nation may limit the amount of funds they acquire. Therefore, the priority is on who the AAG believes stand the strongest possibility of qualifying for the Olympic Games this year. The shortlisted team comprises of Winston George, Cormel Prince, Jeremy Bascom, Emmanuel Archibald, Akeem Stewart, Arenzi Chance, Devon Barrington, Andrea Foster, Ali Abrams and Jasmine Abrams. A manager and coach will also travel when the team is finalized. Hudson told Newsroom Sport on Monday that Olympic qualification certainly is priority, but they are also looking to keep an eye on athletes for the Commonwealth Games and World Championships in 2022. In preparing a budget, because remember we are on very short notice, in preparing a budget, I have to take all the variables into consideration. Mm -hmm. What I am almost certain may have to happen is that some of the athletes uh, may have to provide their own funding to get to these championships. Those that we um, may not necessarily think may make the standards as against those who we know sh that if given an opportunity will make the standards for the Olympics. I still think that we're looking at at least six Six to, between six to eight athletes. I mean, I, I am really and truly shooting for the 12 plus manager and coach. Um, but uh, I think, um, you know, between six to eight of them um, should really and truly push hard to ensure that they get there. But again, you know, council will have to sit and decide on that. The championships were initially stated to be held from May 14 to the 16th in Argentina. What was moved due to the spike in COVID-19 cases and now will be held from May 29 to the 31st in Ecuador. Hudson Ford indicated that track and field is a performance-based sport and the AAG will continue to invest in those who are improving credibly. A track and field is performance-based and um, I don't necessarily look at age um, but what I look at is, is your performance and if if you go out there and you make the time, regardless of your age, then you're entitled to go once you qualify. So in making the investment, if Winston George is, is still running fast and still the national fastest athlete um, at 400 meters, still making our qualifying standards, um, we have an obligation to ensure that Winston George gets to those games and not necessarily um, try to, to say, okay, no, we're not going to send Winston, we're going to send a young athlete who are not making the standards. For me, if you want to go ahead of Winston George, and I'm just using this as an example, then you need to be running faster than Winston George. The AAG will seek support from the government of Guyana, the Guyana Olympic Association, corporate Guyana, and the calendar funding from World Athletics to fund this trip. The championships were last held in Lima, Peru in May 2019. Team Guyana comprised of Devon Barrington, Akeem Stewart, Winston George, Diana McCammon, and Leslie Beard. For the newsroom, Akeem Green.